there's one thing that we are very focused on is making sure we have the environmental health of our rivers and waterways. And that's why it was great to be able to announce the $15 million that we will put towards the eradication of carp, getting the plan going to eradicate carp. We know that it's incredibly important because we are afflicted in this nation, we are afflicted with this disgusting, mud-sucking creatures, bottom-dwelling, mud-sucking creatures. <laughs> for which the only form of control is a version of herpes to try and get rid of these disgusting, <laughs> mud-sucking creatures. But we don't want to have to deal with carp. So get rid of the carp. When we deal with this virus, we're going to have between 500,000 and 2 million tonnes of carp. 2 million tonnes of carp. You're going to need a bigger boat. We have to bury the car, put it outside, put it in the paddocks, put it underground, probably take the, take the place of horse manure or something. And you've got to go to some extreme measures at times to make sure we keep our economy and our environment healthy, even if it does require a version of a venereal disease to deal with it. But if that's what's required, that's what's required, because we're going to get rid of the car.